to before I read George Franklin's poem, Schopenhauer, thought I'd brandish at you the old man's portrait because it hangs on my wall. Naturally then, this poem by my old schoolmate really struck a chord with me. George Franklin, Schopenhauer. Schopenhauer spoke of suicide during the dessert course. The spoon for the trifle, unlikely to do much damage, and the cheese knife too dull to penetrate his woolen vest. No one thought to ask for his shoelaces, or the belt his stomach exceeded. He was a great man. And great men often say silly things, sometimes translated from Greek or Sanskrit. Never to have been born is best. Oh, things are on fire. But later, after everyone had gone to bed, he sat alone, close to the fireplace. A Brahman reciting Vedas before the sacrificial flame. What God heard him as thought dissolved as he stared at this marriage of wood and burning heat? The glow of dying things, a log that could have been a corpse. Shelley likened the mind in death to a fading coal. I read that line like 30 years ago. I don't know where it came from. Anyway, that was George. Good one, George.